Okay, today I'm gonna open up um, Terror Claw Skeletor. How terrifying. Uh, the reason why, well, I mean, the reason why I'm gonna open up Terror Claw Skeletor is because I want to. Uh, let me find my scissors. Found them. I got my favorite scissors. Boing, 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 boing. Look at, okay, so I was house sitting like uh, a week ago, or a couple weeks, actually, yeah, it was a couple weeks ago. Um, and then I have all these, like, the dog, like, bit me a bunch of times. But he's a puppy, so he doesn't really know any better. And that's just how they, like, communicate, I guess. He gets, he gets excited and he, and he bites. Um, so anyway, those are healing. Um, uh, what was I going to say? I don't remember. Oh my gosh. So Terror Claw Skeletor. This reminds me of my childhood because when I was a little kid, um, my dad used to um, always try to cut my fingernails because I would like to, I always liked to grow them out, but then like, um, oh, and I would like use them for self-defense because like, you know, I was a very special child. And uh, I, I think like if kids picked on me, they weren't expecting me to to like scratch them but I would and I would draw blood and I was always really proud of that but then like I would get in trouble at school for doing that and then my dad would sit me down and like cut my fingernails and I always would howl and howl like 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 he was I don't know like cutting my actual fingertips off but he wasn't he was just cutting my fingernails and I was like uh and he was like you can't go around scratching people and I'm like uh but it made me really mad oh and um this is kind of a bummer because he's got Skeletor has vac metal right on his uh chest I think people call him like tank top or like crop top Skeletor because of this well I guess it kind of is a crop top um very sexy Skeletor is is he all the way back metal and he's got blue paint i think that's the case i mean i probably shouldn't do that but i think that is like he's he is vac metal but he's painted blue and i can tell because he's got that little chip right there so we could do some experimentation if you want to do you dare me to because i will i'll do anything okay so anyway so that's the story like so my dad would like cut my fingernails and I would like howl and scream and, and like cry. And he'd be like, you can't go around scratching people. We're gonna cut your fingernails. And I'm like, ugh. And I hated when he would say fingernails because it, it made it sound extra bad rather than just nails, you know? We're gonna cut your nails versus fingernails. I think when you say fingernails, it's, I don't know. I don't know. Anyway, I've always been a rotten kid. I did my best. Oh, and, and I shouldn't, um, I didn't want to like touch him. Does this, does his arms do his arms come out i don't know well, maybe he'll have that little buff today i feel really weird because i was um i was making this <laughs> concoction earlier where um i was grinding up these um organic items and filling um empty capsules with the powder and um and i'm gonna take that as medicine when I go into the desert. Oh, this is why his arms don't come out because he's Terror Claw Skeletor and he goes like this. Okay, um, and anyway, I was like supposed to use gloves when I do that, but I didn't. Well, I did, I did. I started out using gloves because I bought these gloves like specifically for that, but I haven't done it in so long that um, the gloves like deteriorated so when i went to pull the gloves on they went snap and then i was like well i guess i'm doing it raw doggy style so i did and then um i think i i think a lot of that substance touched my skin and so i feel really good here are his claws oh they're so terrifying terror 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 terrifying claws oh my goodness i probably shouldn't tell that story um mm, i made it all up it's all a lie anyway so there we go so anyway i'm really excited <laughs> to take those pills that i made because they're gonna be delicious and i'm gonna have a good time i <laughs> took four i took a couple like just to try them out because i want to see like how many I'm gonna need to take in order to have a real spiritual experience um okay wow okay so here's Terra Claw Skeletor I really like his color scheme it's very amazing um he's got this little uh what do you call that a little dial or something I bet the box I threw the box away that's a battle grip uh okay there's the back of it oh 
hold figure and grip waist, but it doesn't call that anything. I, I was hoping it would call that something. Here's wave um, seven. I already have all these. Mattel, give me something I don't have. Oh, and um, tomorrow morning, because I'm filming this on a Thursday, tomorrow morning, they're going to have that, um, uh, what do you call it? Co Camo Con is going to go out for sale. So that's cool. Okay, here's Spike Ore, Too Bad, Terraclaw Skeletor, and Snake Mountain. But that's also a snake... The Snake Tower from Eternia, you see that? That little monorail track? So that was a secret little, um, I don't know, like a teaser for Eternia when they made this. And then they already sold out of all the Eternia. So you're too late if you didn't buy one. Or you're too late if you did buy one. Because now you're stuck with it. <laughs> uh, okay, so here are... I wonder how much of this video I'm going to have to edit out because I'm um, saying horrible things. Okay, so here is his dinosaur snapper i i got distracted because i saw this and i thought it was words but it's just a i guess it's just like a hydraulic hose or something oh my gosh i feel like i'm yeah i think four is the right amount oh i feel so good okay so you go like this oh gosh so this is just flopping his dinosaur around good wow very effective okay interesting interesting you got a little dino flopper and oh that's when i was a oh i still am i was gonna say when i was an artist but i still am i have to work on these drawings um no i probably shouldn't say that we'll edit that part out too okay so let's try his um terror claws on him oh how do you do it oh you just do it like this they snap on the wrist or on the oh yeah mm -hmm. Four is the right amount. Want to see something really cool? Okay. <laughs> okay, so you take this, and you hold it up to your light, or you hold it up to your camera, and then you go like this, and then you hold it right up to the camera, and then you go like this. Terra Claw Skeletor, Terra Claw Skeletor, Terra Claw Skeletor, Terra Claw Skeletor. I'm going to get you in so many dimensions, three dimensions. Oh my gosh. Yeah, I think that's perfect. That was the best thing for me to do today. And now I want to go running on my treadmill and go swimming. I'm going to do both. Okay, back to the video. Okay, so that was really cool. Um, oh, what was I doing? Oh, yeah, this. Okay, so back to Terra Claw Skeletor. There you go. Okay. Um, okay, so here are his claws. So he, imagine, like, um, there's a wall or something. He he has he sees a wall and he's like, oh no, this wall is nothing for a terror claw skeleton. And he just terror claws his way right through it. That's pretty cool. So I haven't opened up like a skeletor figure in a long time. Um, I appreciate that he has a havoc staff. And this is a kind of a brighter, a, a really a rah, 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 rah. that's what puppies say. A really bright purple. Uh thing that he's got there a very bright purple havoc staff and very bright purple um hood that he has so he's very very bright purple let me go grab another i'll grab all my skeletors i was gonna grab all my skeletors but they're way too high up and i can't reach them okay so this this one looks so angry does this one look angry too oh no but look he looks like he's laughing and then this one he just looks like he's like smiling but evil smiling okay so the very dark and this is very bright if you put them like right together yeah so this is super bright this is like a really um a much darker one wow um i don't know what i'm gonna do because so i have to go put this one all the way back up over there um okay so anyway uh i guess this is my video for terror claw skeletor terror claw skeletor oh and do you dare me to scratch to see just for curiosity because like what are you gonna do right okay so i just want to see oh please internet don't hate me but you can hate me if you want I, oh maybe i should just do it up here maybe like um because i this is i'm uh not speaking i have to speak and say my words use your words what i'm trying to do is uh i saw on the front of him this may be too bright and too close on the front of him there's this little like um i don't know if that's a chip in the paint but it's like a little silver spot so it sparked my curiosity and made me think is he all vac metal 
and then just like painted blue. And I don't really know how that works, but probably like they probably did that and then just maybe painted this one magenta and then just painted in blue. So what I'm gonna do is just kind of like scratch here to see if there's anything underneath. Oh, I don't know. Ooh, oh wow, it is. So underneath his, um, so he's got blue paint, blue, blue Skeletor paint. And then underneath that, he's vac metal. So that's pretty neat. You could go and scratch off all of the, um, all of the blue Skeletor paint to reveal a purple, just an all purple Skeletor. And then he won't have to be wearing a tank top. And then I wonder if there's like supposed to be something there, like a, a logo or something I don't know or maybe oh who cares I don't I don't even have the brain to speculate on things and there's a big glob of paint there so anyway I think that's gonna be my video I probably shouldn't have done that but it's okay I forgive myself well have a really good day oh and by the way um, I put his head on and you can't even see the scratches that I made so that's good so now I double forgive myself. So I did a little bit of science. I learned a thing. And then now I'm mad at Mattel for giving me one that's that has a chip there. I'm like, oh, they cheaped out. But I went and scratched it on the back over here. Okay, for now. Oh, wait, I didn't even do this. Okay, then he can put his weapon, this, this thing, in here. Oh, gosh. Or maybe it's this. Maybe it's this. I don't know, I'm too... I'm too lazy and relaxed to really worry about it. Actually, I'm going to go get the box again. Whoa. Okay, so it goes like that. So there's its evil face. Oh, it's so evil. Such an evil monster. Chomp, chomp, chomp. And then it like, just like this part here goes there. So it's like this. Oh, okay, holds it in place, and then you can put his little claws on him. We're gonna cut your fingernails, Greg. You can't go around scratching people at school. Yes, I can. <laughs> yes, I can. Oh my gosh, now I can. I can do anything I want. I don't really need to scratch anybody now, though. I'm pretty peaceful now. Oh, I'm bring okay. So then there he goes. So he's fully loaded now. So I don't know what he what he wants to do with his uh, havoc staff when he uh, when he's got his all when he's got his all, 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 when he's got his claws on and he's got his little dinosaur backpack back there, talking into his ear, saying, "You know what we should do now, Skeletor? We should go do something evil." And he's like, "Good idea." And he goes off with his terror claws and then battle armor, battling the armor. Okay, well, I have a lot of other stuff to do today, like day off, because it's my day off. <sighs> That's why I'm not in a hurry. Um, yeah, so I have a lot of things to do today. I'm very busy, and I'm going to go do them now. <laughs>